And Health Watch tonight, a first of its kind treatment option for women with early stage breast cancer. It's a way to deliver radiation treatments faster and more safely. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez tells us about the breast gamma pod. That's right. And you know, women with early stage breast cancer can usually have a lumpectomy, but she must also have radiation treatments to the area where the tumor used to be to prevent local recurrence. That can take weeks and can cause heart and lung damage. Here's a faster, safer way. Joyce McCain's breast cancer was picked up in a routine mammogram. Because of her active lifestyle, she opted for a lumpectomy with radiation. Then doctors explained there could be side effects for the heart. That gave me something else, you know, to start worrying about. Because breasts lie directly over the heart in orange and the lungs in blue and green, they're often in the path of radiation beams, which can lead to heart damage and lung cancer decades later. Now there's a new FDA cleared device called the Gamma Pod that can deliver high doses of radiation to the breast and spare nearby vital organs. The woman lies face down or prone so that her breast is pulled down and away from the chest wall. But the real key is that the Gamma Pod delivers dozens of thin radiation beams from many angles that all converge on the area where the tumor was removed. It's targeted on the lumpectomy cavity plus that rim of tissue around it. There's essentially innumerable paths that the radiation can take that all converge on the, the target area with a high dose, but through any given beam path, there's essentially a negligible amount of radiation. Not only does that spare the heart and lungs, it also reduces the radiation that other normal tissue receives, which means... We can actually deliver a little bit of a higher dose of radiation per day for a shorter time frame. We're seeing that the fatigue is significantly less for women undergoing this therapy, and the skin reaction is also significantly improved. Now, the Gamma Pod is for women with early stage breast cancer after their lumpectomy. But Dr. Nichols is looking at a clinical trial for elderly women with early non aggressive cancers as a standalone treatment. Now, right now, the Gamma Pod is only available at the University of Maryland Medical Center where it was developed, but several other sites will also be accepting patients soon. So it's a different way that you can survive this and not have a problem down the road. Very good. Thank All you, right. Dr. Yeah, Max. Doc.